Holy crap, this is going to be a big show today. Fresh talk! <laughs> Stupid. We've got a huge show today. We got a fantastically large bin of toys that we are going to raise up here and show you all the toys. And we also have our mascot because believe it or not, most of the toys here today are Jurassic Park toys from this fantastic bin. So let's get started right away. When I first was in the store, I saw this. I saw this toy right here and it grabbed my attention and right away I knew it was Jurassic Park. But his face, when he was in the bin, he was all smashed was like <gasps> that. So I was like, oh no, the poor dinosaur. So I had to save him. Dino damage! And then I started going through the bin and it was all Jurassic Park. And I was like, holy crap, I want this bin right now. So yeah, this was this was the bullhead T-Rex. He was the one that could swallow, like you put the, the guy. Somewhere in here is the guy. You put him in a cage and then you, you pull him out of the belly. He's like, oh, but we have to be careful because these, these toys are old and the rubber, it can peel. So you, want, you don't want to rip the rubber. Oh yeah, it is pretty old. Yeah, it's an old toy. All right, <laughs> let's get going through this. It's going to be fantastic. <laughs> ah! We send all the T-Rex. This is a, uh, a puppet one. Oh. Uh, you go in here. He's like, oh, you think your T-Rex is better than my T-Rex, but I'm really better because look at the detail that he has on his rubber head. It's fantastic. Rubber head. We got a rubber whole head. bunch of T-Rexes here. We got, got a this, whole bunch of T-Rex. This T-Rex, you pull the T, the, uh, the, the, remember where they bite? Yeah. And they get the pieces, you could chew on them. But yeah, so we got that one. I hear this one is actually relatively rare. If you find him on eBay, he usually goes for like 80 to to $100 just for these. And we got two of them. Look at that, they're so fantastic. There's so the many dinosaurs sister. on set. <laughs> Here's another one. Nice detailed T-Rex. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, this is... A, you're a piece of shit compared to me. Look at you, you look like <laughs> asshole. But me? Great detail. We got this. I think it's called the st uh, Stegosaurus. And another another T Rex. He's all like caged up. He goes with his brothers there. We got tons of these Velociraptors. Look at the the. This one's a little bit darker, different style, lighter style. I think this was from Site B. So this was from the 1997 Velociraptor movie which was the last world Jurassic Park. It's not called Velociraptor movie. <laughs> These are Dilophosaurus. Dilophosaurus, there's the one that spit in your eye and make you go blind and you have rabies afterwards and then you have vomit poop for like a week. Uh, this one from Jurassic Park 3. That's the only one I think we have from Jurassic Park 3. And we got this one right here. What is this one? Uh, that's, that's actually from Jurassic World. He's a oh. new style. Uh, this was the baby T-Rex from Lost World. He's okay. got the broken leg. You can take his cast off right here real quick and see it broken. Uh, then they, the doctors can fix him. It's fantastic. <laughs> do you, what's this one called? Do you know? I do not know. It's a what? Spinosaurus. The Spinosaurus. Is that accurate? Yes. That's not accurate. It's not called a Spinosaurus. Velociraptor. Uh, look at that, he's getting all wimpy. <laughs> you can see his head is like coming down. He's got like, he's got back syndrome. <laughs> More of these guys. We got uh, this one, uh, the Triceratops, I believe he's called, Triceratops. Those of you who are dinosaur experts, I'm sure you know the names a lot better than I can. Here is uh, another Velociraptor. He's like blind in one eye. He's got the blind eye, you but he's like, he's like you tried to get him out. He's like, I can't get out. Oh yeah, because he's trapped. Dilophosaurus without the wingspan thing for you, the diarrhea rabies. Uh, so that, that's another, he's like a little squishy style. I think he, he actually used put water in him and you can put, squeeze the water out. We got a bunch of these baby dinosaurs. They're called... Uh, baby dinosaurs. Peeping Tom dinosaurs, I think. <laughs> More Velociraptors. We're gonna fill this whole table up with dinosaurs, right? Okay, we got the couple. Now we're moving on to some vehicles that we have in there. Check out this vehicle from Lost World Jurassic Park style. Right here. Can I bring this one up? Oh yeah, bring that one up. That's from the very first movie. This oh. was the ones they go through the park. Yeah, when the cup of water, they go doom, doom, doom. Yeah, the cup yep. of water, boom, boom, dinosaur style. 
But yeah, so that's that one. This one too is pretty expensive on eBay if you want to find it. Uh, you'll pay a nice pretty penny for it because, you know, again, it's from the very first series of the toys and it's a very popular vehicle. Uh, the Lost World. Yeah, this, this, ve this vehicle here is from the Lost World Jurassic Park. Uh, you push that down, I think a dinosaur would like hit it and it pop up, you know, and be like, oh. Dino strike! Uh, you know, a lot of these vehicles had the dino damage, you know, where you bite into it. Dino with, damage? Yeah, and they okay. would take it like, oh, I'm a dinosaur and I'm taking it from you. It does have a lot of weapons in it. Yeah. But for some reason, it's always get a uh, dino damage. Of course, yeah. The, yeah. When the dinosaurs bite into a vehicle, you have to assume they are going to cause pain for the vehicle. So this one right here is kind of a combination of vehicle and playset. Because uh, so this is an electric fence that uh, would go around the toy. We do not have the room, but it would, you can plug it in and go around an electric security fence for the uh, the uh, what do you call this thing? What is it? It's like uh, the mobile trailer command yeah, the trailer, center. Yeah, it's a trailer. But yeah, so th you know it's a place that they can come out to do things. Dino damage. It opens right here, so you can set it out. There's uh, the workstation for the, 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 the people who work with the dinosaurs. Here, yeah, shoot it into my hand, I'll catch it. That didn't go far at all, that was terrible. That's why they always lose to the dinosaurs. We have a whole bunch of baggies of the action figures. Here is a, uh, this one is the double barreled uh, Alan Grant from series two. So an Alan Grant, he's got his baby little dinosaurs. A lot of them have the dinosaurs. Yeah, Alan Grant. Series one. Series one, Alan Grant, fantastic. Ian Malcolm, series two. Uh, the Dino Track Tracker and accessories. Yeah, I guess it's from like. Oh, this is Dino Tracker Adventure Set one or two, and uh, yeah. So th th uh, this this dinosaur too, I'll take him out for you so that you can see. Wait, I don't remember Jaws Jackson. This but dinosaur is relatively rare right here, uh, but yeah, so this, if you ever find this one, you know, he's a, he's a good keeper one. A lot of people want him on the eBay. What do you got there? Uh, Jaws Jackson. The thing about the Jurassic Park toys is that they would come up with a lot of characters in the toy line that were not in the movie. Okay. Uh, so they had like a couple of characters. They did like Alan Grant, he's from the movie, but this is just a creation for the toy line. Oh, okay. You'll always, now not, not every single Jurassic Park toy like this one from the Dino Tracker Adventure Set has a JP. Number six? But most of the, the Jurassic Park will have the JP symbol so you know it's Jurassic Park and they have numbers by them. But uh, they mean jack squat to me. We got another uh, Dino Tracker and accessory guy. Here we got Nick Van Owen, 1997. That was the uh, Vince Vaughn character from Lost World Jurassic Park. Dino Tracker, Sergeant T-Rex Turner. I don't know, this guy looks like Crocodile Dundee. Yeah, he's the Crocodile Dundee of the Lost World. Okay. He's a butthole. Okay. Oh, you found the fantastic one. Right oh, here. I do? Yeah. Well, what is this? So Sarah? Sarah Harding, that was uh, Ian Malcolm's girlfriend. But this toy, this toy is actually a very rare toy. There was not a lot of these ones made, uh, including this one. This one was exclusive with this set. Really? A lot of people want this one. You look on eBay for this guy, girl right here, the daughter for Ian Malcolm. Yeah, they're very hard to find her. Really? Hmm. Wait, is this... This guy looks like Chris Pratt from yeah. the Lost World. One. Yeah, that's the uh, Jurassic World. Jurassic yeah, World. Yeah, Chris Pratt character. So he's pretty new. I don't know how... He, but uh, yeah, so he's whatever. Deirter, Deirter Stark. Mm, I don't know, not, oh, uh, he might, might have been somebody, I think he was maybe in the Lost World Jurassic Park. The Skinner. Oh yeah, he's pretty fantastic. Look at his arm right there. Yeah, look skin. Yeah, he got pretty beat up. You can see that his arm is like chewed. No, is that the character itself or is it just the way? That's just a toy. Again, this was okay. not a character that was in the movie. They just released like, oh, we need to sell more toys. We better make some stupid character instead of, we could make somebody who's in the movie, but we don't. Robert Muldoon, series two, right here. Ooh, another Alan Grant, series two. Oh, okay, so this is uh, Alan Grant with the white. He's got the white this time, right here you can see that, very nice. Peter Ludlow. He kind of, he kind of a little bit looks like uh, Arnold. Nah, he kind of looks like Arnold, but no, he kind of looks like a toy, like the Ghostbuster guy. Oh uh, yeah, he does. Like okay. he's got the, yeah, he's got like a problem that he looks like he's a Ghostbuster. Harpoon Harrison from series two. 
Uh, we got a an Eddie Carr. Yeah, I think he he died in the movie of yeah. the Lost World. Yeah, I think he he's the one that got swallowed up by the the T Rex, the Mama T Rex and the Daddy T Rex. Yeah. <laughs> Ellie Sattler, series one, she with the pink. She's wearing her pink. Dennis Nidri. That's the guy who got the Dilophosaurus spit in his eye. And he's like, arr, arr, arr. <laughs> Feel bad for him. Here, Tim Murphy. He's the one that was uh, climbing the 10,000 volt electricity thing when it went bam, and he went flying. And, and we got another Dino Tracker adventure set. Two of two. This Dino Tracker adventure set, the two of two, uh, that goes with uh, this guy here. We are missing one of the dinosaurs, but this is actually a very rare set. If you can find it, you're spending big money on eBay to get that because people are greedy. Roland Tembo. Roland Tembo, 1997, Lost World style. I don't know. I don't know all these names. Oh, this Ian Malcolm from The Lost World, I think this is series one Ian Malcolm one. So there's two Ian Malcolms, one from 1993, this one from 1997. Malcolm's loaded with weapons. They chase down a Gallimimus in the capture cruiser. Got him! Right here, this is that guy in the cage I was telling you about that goes inside of that dinosaur, he swallows him. Okay. Another Robert Muldoon series one. This, this one is different, because there's the Robert Muldoon that is in the movie. This one looks nothing like him. But then they did the series two. I don't know where he is now. He got buried. But yeah, this one is a lot more accurate. Uh, this this one is much more accurate than this one. This one's basically poop. We have this playset, Jurassic Park style playset, and the, again with the Dino damage where they bite into it. Ah! The Jurassic Park gate, you know, so that the dinosaurs can't escape, even though they easily could. <laughs> it's the Jurassic Park command compound with an electronic computer that says over a hundred commands. The, the place that comes with the 10,000 volt cages, they go all the way around, you know, so attached to the gate, they come and they attach to this. Ah. Yeah, th this, this is the top for that, so it goes on top there, so it looks all, you know, like they're in Hawaii, having a time of their life. This looks pretty cool. Fire the net! <laughs> Got him! Whatever. That doesn't go on top. I told you that's the top. Jurassic Park electronic talking command compound figures and dinosaurs sold separately. Batteries not included. Here's Forty another. Eight. This is another vehicle from the Lost World Jurassic oh, that's Park cool style. Hum. That's a cool Humvee. Yeah, it, it's got this Hummer. thing that goes on the back. It connects to the back. They drive around and they capture dinosaurs with it. You guys grew up in the 90s or maybe the 80s. You guys probably know what these are. <laughs> you know, a little L, uh, LCD video game handheld game but it's actually Jurassic Park that's oh fun. man this is pretty cool so yeah that's it this is the entire Jurassic Park bin right here that we all share for you so that you can tell us does this bring back childhood memories for you brings back a little bit for me because I had some of these toys when I was a kid you know I really enjoyed mm. the Jurassic Park toys I play in the dirt and drive trucks around T-Rex would chomp on vehicles it's just like how you would do it back in Austria yeah well yeah back in Austria vintage Austria oh yeah if you really enjoyed seeing us unbox this giant bin of Jurassic Park toys please leave a comment like the video, subscribe to our channel. We are so excited every time that we are opening a bin and showing toys. You need to tell everybody. You need to tell your cousin in jail. You need to tell your uncle in jail. You need to tell Grandma Betty, who's also in jail. Everybody needs to know how wonderful it is out here where the toys are. Please subscribe. Billy Mays here with another fantastic product. Killing hookers in your shower, got blood all over, no problem. Kaboom! It's gone. Somebody eating spaghetti in your toilet, no problem. Kaboom! It's gone.